hey guys welcome back to my channel so this will be look number two in the holiday glam series right now I'm just priming my eyes with the elf shadow lock eyelid primer and I'm putting that all over my eyelid of course to make sure that my eyeshadow does not crease and it lasts all day Then going in with the transition color, I'm using the Makeup Forever Powder Foundation in 218. It works well for me. Um, and I'm using the brush number 7 in the BH Cosmetics Shimmering Bronze 12 piece brush set to put that product on. Now I'm going in with a gold color that the BH Cosmetic Blush Neutrals 26 color eyeshadow and blush palette have and I'm using brush number 10 to put pat that product on to make sure that it will show up really really well. Now going in with brush number six, I'm using the BH Cosmetic 88 color palette in a color brown to use in my outer V and I'm smudging that all the way into my crease. And of course I'm using brush number nine it's a big fluffy blending brush and I'm just blending out those harsh lines to make sure that everything flows smoothly and I'm highlighting the arch of my eyebrows with a light brown color in the 88 color palette and I'm using brush number nine now going in with some gold glitter yes I'm using a product from a local company at my mall. It's called Wink. And I'm using a the same brush that I used before to put the gold glitter on. Right now, I'm coating the top lash of my eyes with the Wet n Wild Mega Length Waterproof Mascara. And then I'm going to do a second coat with the Tarte Light camera lashes mascara and I don't do the wing lighter or put lashes on I just don't feel like they look good for me <laughs> right now we're on to the face I'm using LA Girl Pro Conceal in Fine and I'm going to highlight underneath my eyes, my forehead, my nose, my cupid bow, and um, my chin. Now all of these products that I'm mentioning, you can find at your local beauty supply store or at um, your local drug store. All of these products are very inexpensive. The only thing that you may pay a little money for is Tarte and the Makeup Forever Powder Foundation, but everything else is very inexpensive. Then I'm going in to blend everything out. I'm using the brush number eight in that 12 piece brush set. It's a really cool brush. It looks like a brush up close and then when you look um look at it it has kind of like a flat top to it but it helps me get into those creases and i'm really starting to like it then i'm just using a beauty blender to blend everything out a little further now to set everything I'm using the elf translucent mattifying powder and of course I really like this I used it the last time it has a peachy pinkish tint to it um it really works well for me and I don't get oily <laughs> now I'm just going in with the NYX conceal correct contour in the deep and I'm using the darkest color in that palette to contour my face
then I'm just blending everything out with the smudger end of um, I forgot the name of the brush I'm sorry <laughs> Now I'm going in with the 88 color palette with the brown that I used before and I'm just putting that all on top of the con the concealer that I used before to contour to make sure that it stays and I'm just using the L professional bronzing brush to do all of that. All right. I'm using brush number two to put on my foundation powder and of course this is the makeup forever in the 218 now using the brush number three and I'm going in the in with that same 26 color eyeshadow and blush palette and it's a peachy pinkish color and I'm using that as my blush now I'm just lining my waterline with a black eye pencil I forgot the name of it I'm sorry and then I'm just coating my bottom lashes with the same two mascaras that I used before now on to the lips I am lining my lips with the NYX Lip Liner Pencil in Prune. I really, really love this color on everything. Um, and I'm just using that as a base. Then for the actual lip color, I'm using LA Girl Matte Flat Finish Pigment Gloss in Backstage say that five times let's see if you make it <laughs> I really really like this color um, in the bottle it actually came darker but I really like it on my lips really really do now I'm just setting everything with the elf makeup mist and set so this is the final look I'm sorry I did not pull down my hair but let me know what you guys think and I'll talk to you later like that but it is very pretty if you haven't gotten on Kat Von D lipsticks I don't know you you just tripping they last all day long now they may dry out your lips a little bit but all you have to do is put a little gloss on it and you're good to go so of course I forgot one step and that is to set everything and off camera I use the elf makeup mist and set and that's the spray to just set everything and make sure that your makeup lasts all day so this is the final look if you guys like then thumbs up this video let me know what you think there will be more holiday looks to come also remember to subscribe and I'll talk to you guys later bye